Good morning, boys and girls. So yesterday we learned about sequencing. Do you remember what sequence means? It means to put in order. When we are doing how-to books, we have to make sure we're telling others how to do something in order, starting with the first step all the way to the last. So some of the words we have learned is first, next, then, and last. When I do my videos and when I show you things I do, I make sure to use those sequencing words because we're going to be using them a lot. So, what are we doing today? We are going to do more sequencing. <laughs> okay. We use sequencing every day of our lives. So, think of something you do every day. What are things you do every day? Hmm. I, every day, I get ready. So I get dressed. I do my makeup. Okay. I get my lunch together. Another thing I do is get my baby's lunch together, right? So Jacob needs snacks. He needs lunch. He, he needs to take a whole bunch of stuff to the babysitter with him diapers. So I also get that ready either in the morning or the night before. So that's another thing I do every day. I eat breakfast. I make breakfast and eat breakfast every day. I also make coffee. Yeah, that is a must. I need my coffee. So every morning I make coffee. So that is what I'm going to show you. You are going to watch me make coffee. And while I make the coffee, I'm going to use some important words. What kind of words do you think? Sequencing words. Yeah. I'm going to use the words first, next, then, and last. Ready to watch me make coffee? All right. All right. I'm going to show you how I make coffee every morning. This is my coffee maker. I have to make sure that the top is up before I do anything. So, top is up. Now I'm ready to start. First, I pour in water. Can't do it too fast or it will spill. All right. Then I gotta make sure the coffee pot is back under. Otherwise, when I press the on button, it will make a big mess. So, first water, then coffee, the coffee ground. So I take my coffee spoon and I need three scoops for the amount of coffee that I'm making. One, two, And then I have to press the on button. Otherwise, the coffee will not be made. Square now. And there it goes. The coffee is being made. So those are three steps so far. First, water. Second, coffee. Third, on. Oh, you can hear it. Can you hear it? All right, now we just gotta wait. All right, my coffee is ready. So I have my mug ready to go. It's my Hawaii mug that my friend designed. So I get to pour my yummy coffee. Ooh, it's hot. And then Ooh, that's hot. So, when I go back and review my steps, first, I poured in water. Next, I put in the coffee. Then, I pushed the on button. And last, I poured my coffee in a cup and got to drink it. 
Mm. Now it's time to sequence our coffee making. So the first thing I did was pour in water. So I'm going to move my picture of pouring water to the first box, box number one. Next, I put in the coffee. So I'm going to move the picture of me putting in coffee to box two. Then I press the on button. So I'm moving this picture of me pressing the on button to number three. And last, I poured coffee for myself and then drink it. So I'm going to put the picture of me pouring coffee into the number four box. There you have it. We have sequenced our coffee making. First, I poured water into the coffee maker. Next, I put coffee into the coffee maker. Then I turned on the coffee maker. And last, I poured my coffee into a cup and enjoyed it. Now it's your turn. I want you to make a video of something you do every day. So think real hard, just like I did, about things you do every day. I want you to take a video of yourself and use your sequencing words. First, next, then, and last, just like I did. Okay, sound good? Good, I can't wait to see your work.